Because you know this case puts some of us in a very precarious situation. And I have said it on the floor of this house. Because I contested for governorship in Kajiado. And I was hoping your success in Meru will propel me to governorship in Kajiado. But today, three months after the election, there is an outcry in Meru. Will this, will, 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 will really your behavior in Meru help to propel more women into positions or will it bring us down? These are my worries, my dear sister. You know about the women movement. You know about the women who went before us. Akina Fibia Sio, Akina Grace Ogot, Jane Kiano, Julia Ojiampo, Zipora Kiton, Charity Ngilu, Mother Karwa, and more recently, Governor Waiguru, Governor Sisli Mbarire, Governor Gladys Wanka, Governor Achani, Governor Susan Kihika. You know about the League of Kenya Women Voters? You know about Center for Multiparty Democracy? You know what it has costed the women of this country to create space for leadership. Will you be the downfall of the women of Kenya? Will you bring... The, because you must see your actions, not just to affect the people of Meru, but to affect the women movement, to affect the girl child, even those we have given birth to. I am sorry to speak this way, because you must be told the truth, that you must be able to tame your tongue, you must be able, now that you are the victor, to know that it is the victor who needs everyone else. It's not everyone else who needs 